In his office on the 73rd floor of Chase Tower, we can see the entire city. Tony Busby has sharks everywhere, shark door handles, a sculpture, and not just any shark, the great white. Now we're the biggest and we're the baddest and we're just floating around looking for something to eat. Typical Busby, talks big, lives big. One, two, three into the boat. Snoop Doggy Dog and Dr. Dre is at the dope. A man who throws multi-million dollar holiday parties with entertainers like Snoop Dogg. Collects exotic cars and expensive art. Look how beautiful that is. It's gorgeous. This one's like three million. A lifestyle paid for by his tenacity in the courtroom. Somebody described me once as a, a bulldozer with a flamethrower. I thought that was fairly accurate. What do we call this, the Wall of Fame? <laughs> on his wall, articles on court victories and high dollar settlements against big oil companies. He often represents families of workers who've been killed or maimed on the job. I don't get paid to be nice. I don't get paid, um, you know, I'm not, your, I'm not your counselor. I'm the guy that goes out and kicks ass for you and gets you checks like that. Not bad for a scrawny kid from a tiny Texas town whose dad was a butcher and his mom a school cafeteria worker. After graduating from Texas A&M, he joined the Marines. It's all he ever wanted to be, he said. Then a fellow Marine suggested he take the law school admission test. He did, and it changed the course of his life. How much money did you make on your first big win? About 18.6 million. I bought a Mercedes and I thought I was the king of the world. Now he has a rotating stable of expensive wheels, Ferrari, Lamborghini, Rolls Royce, and a $40 million art collection. Monet, uh, this is Renoir. I don't know if I've ever met anyone this wealthy, so eager to show off his lifestyle, often posting about it on social media. Because it's not like, hey, look at me, uh, you know, I'm better than you. That's certainly not so my what do you what do you what's your intent my intent is like stuff. guys look how awesome life is for us look what we can accomplish look at this guy because for me I'm still I'm still the cafeteria workers boy you're a long way from that but that's how I still feel now the guy who says he has more money than he can spend wants to be mayor of Houston which means he'll be scrutinized over things he'd like to forget like a DWI arrest in 2016 even though the charges were dismissed. Why were you pulled over? Asked the cop that pulled me over. Had you been drinking? I'd been drinking, yeah, I'd been drinking. I Look, I drank with two fists, I punched with two fists, I hugged with two fists. But you weren't drunk? No, 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 yeah. that's why it got dismissed. It's obvious Busby has a bit of a chip on his shoulder. We will see if he can master politics as well as he masters a courtroom.